Hello, Susan. Uh, I'm sorry. I, I wish I can make it, but I can't. I'm sorry. I swear to God, it's not in personal law. It's not in. Please wait, it's nothing. Please don't say that now, please. Suzanne, hello? Oh, oh, wow, she hung up. Who was that on the phone? An old friend that might never call me again, thanks to you. What do you mean, thanks to me? What did I do wrong? It is more like, what didn't you do wrong? I beg, I beg, I beg. See, my body did pepper me. Mori, you're confusing me the more. See, I'm going to the children's school to see why the principal is calling me. I don't have time for this nonsense. You're confusing yourself. Mori. Mori, wait. Mori, wait. Wait. Mori. Mori. Mori, wait. Mori, wait. Mori. Mori, wait. What? Mori. What is it, Dennis? Mori, what is wrong? You, you, you seem angry. Yes, I am angry, Dennis. Why won't I be angry? You're angry at me? Yes! <sighs> but, but, but what did I do wrong? Hey, Jesus. Here he goes again with the dumb question. Okay, can you just calm down <laughs> and tell me what is going on? You want to know what you did? Yes. I just turned down another invitation from one of my closest friends, thanks to you. But, 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 but why now? Why did you turn it down? Because I can't go to the party looking like a papa. Dennis, all the friends that have invited me for the past few years will finally realize the reason why I have been turning down their invitation. Because I can't look like this, going to meet my friends looking lovely. Why are you talking like this now, eh? You know, you know my condition is not... Why wouldn't I talk like this, Dennis? Why wouldn't I talk like this? Oh, ever since I got married to you, Dennis, it has been from one frustration, tolerance and suffering. I am tired! Can you just bring down your voice? Neighbors can hear us, please, now. Really? Neighbors! Neighbors can hear us! No, Let them know now. Let them know that you have this? frustrated me, Dennis. You is, have frustrated me. My condition is not permanent now, my love. I told you. Maureen. Leave me alone. Maureen. Huh? Maureen. Just give me time and everything goes so I know you've been trying, I know you've been patient But a little more and everything goes so Because you know there's nothing I want to fall And you know there's no way I want to fall What happened? It's uh, really... School is not over until it's 1pm What are you doing at home? Daddy, they chased us out from school. They chased you out? Is it, is it because of the school fees? Yes. Um, the principal that wanted to see you were, you, were you able to see her? Yes. Their teacher reported them to the principal and she invited me. She said she doesn't want to see our kids in school until they pay their school fee and get some textbooks. Um, my babies. 
Um, Angel, take your sister inside, okay? I want to have a conversation with your mother. Mm -hmm. Oh, I'm coming yet? Yeah? I'll come and join you, okay? What? My love. Akugo. My beautiful wife. I, I, I just want to beg you of something. About your friend's name ceremony. Please, can you use one of your clothes? Hmm? One of your old school. Okay. Can you use one of your clothes and, uh, and attend the ceremony, please? Hey, Jesus. Which of my clothes are you talking about? Is it the outdated ones? It's not that bad now. Yeah? Oh, you can still manage it. You're a beautiful oh, woman. If you wear it, it will not there. Yeah? Dennis, the last time you got me clothes was four years ago. So you think they will not be outdated till now? Oh, okay, okay. Let me assume that I want to manage the outdated clothes. What about my hair? Look at what about my hair. The last time when you got married to me, my hair was palmed. Fine. Look at my hair. No, look at it. What am I going to do with this hair? Is it this hair you want me to take to the event? Look at it. Look at it now. That's turned virgin. Lack of relaxer. Nothing. Or should I talk about my footwear? See, don't annoy me, oh. Don't annoy me. I know. I know you've been able to endure some of these lacks, okay? But it's just temporal, okay? Things will get better. Temporal? You've been saying that and it's beginning to sound like an alarm. Things are not getting better. Imagine a full grown man like you lying down by this time of the day. How can anything get better? Nothing can get better. Baby, Leave me alone! Leave me alone! Baby, listen to me. I am trying my best to make sure I provide for you and my girls, okay? See, just, just, just give me more time. Believe me when I tell you that things will definitely get better for us mm. in this family. Eh? At least because of our baby. I'm working really hard to make sure that I, I, I provide money for you and my children. Dennis. Just, just endure for, for, for some time, okay? Your best just, is not good enough. No. Leave me alone. I can't be suffering like this. I was not built for this, I beg. Carry on. Hey, 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 I know it's hard, but everything goes south. But all I need is patience. Just give me time and everything goes south. This one that Maureen hasn't said a word to me since this evening. That means no show for me. I wouldn't even dare whisper that into her ear right now. And I was really hoping that tonight will be the night, child. Another friend is gone. All because I couldn't make it to her event. Hmm. She didn't even reply to my apology message. But why would she, when I already made it obvious that she meant nothing to me? Let me try my look. Baby, I've missed you. I missed you. I swear I've missed you so much. You know it's been a long time since we, we made love. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Come to me. If you value this your hand, you better take it off my body. Before I cut it off. Baby, no, baby. Baby, please no. Baby. It's been a long time now, babe. Please, uh, where I am right now, I cannot go back. Home. Yeah? Please, let me just, just... Take this, take, take, take these hands off me. What is your problem? Don't, don't wake my children up. No, you better respect no, yourself. No, they are fast asleep. I made sure of that, yeah? yeah? Please just quickly do it. I will make sure I will not take time. This thing has taken me somewhere. I don't even know what to do. Right? My friend, take your hands off me. Even if it's small. Mm -hmm. I promise you, I will not take time. Even if it's small. Yes. We've not finished feeding our children. You want to get me pregnant again? Hi. I can't withdraw now. I will cut your hand off. I will cut this hand. I'm warning you. 
don't do this to me. You don't listen, Abby. Get your hands off me. Mummy, ah! you're disturbing us. <laughs> Oh, and I, I thought the principal warned that they shouldn't be seen in the school premises if the school fees is not cleared. Yes, but we can't let them stay in the house so that the whole compound will know that they cannot afford to pay their school fees. Okay, so where are they going to? My cousin's house. They'll be there till 1 p.m. When other children are coming back from school, they'll come back home. Uh-uh, Maureen. But is it necessary? I mean, you can still... My darlings. Please, let's go. Yeah? Mm. Bye, Daddy. How far now? At the what's up now? How far the work now, bro? I beg. The work never starts. I really need job, bro. Eh? I need money, seriously. Well, I'm not, you know. Okay, so um, uh, uh, when do you go start? Uh, I said they run something for the old site. Once I finish work today, we go proceed to the new site. Wait, to the old site is still there on? Yes, now. Ha! How you not tell me all this while? Now, just small work. You know, if you can carry block and mix cement, the climb staircase now, nah, Abby. Ah, ah, now, which kind of talk you they talk like this? Which one be saying, no, if you carry block and cement now? Eh? Why they look for money? Eh, eh, I beg, how much do they pay? Now, nah, like 15 to 20k per day, but if you do it, depending on how many blocks you carry. 10 to 15k? Eh? I go do them. You sure? Hi! Now you start. I go do them now. I beg, I they come now, 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 I beg. I beg, no use, no use to replace me with another person, no. I beg, now my work with that, I beg. <laughs> and I thank you, eh? Thank you. Hi. I know it's hard, but everything goes up. Well, all I need is patience. Just give me time and everything goes up. I know you've been trying. I know you've been patient. But a little more. Hey. 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 How are you? Hey, how is it going now? Hey, I have a surprise for you. Hey, just collect it first, yeah? Obin, uh, collect it first and find out for yourself. <laughs> hey. Where did you get this? You like them? You haven't still answered my question. I, I, I bought them for you now. So you used money to buy these things that looked like something you picked from someone's trash can? Like this. You spent money on this. Uh, yes, now, my love. I, I spent money on them. You, you can still check them. They still have tags on it. Okay, okay see, see. There's still tags now. Look, they still have tags. Of course, tags. you should oh, have them. tags now. Huh? It's made from Abba. They are Abba made. Abi, are they not Abba made? Is it not Abba? Uh, don't worry now. Very soon you start wearing all those Italian uh, uh, things. Have you forgotten who your husband is? <laughs> you know, just try them on. Eh? So that I can see how it looks on this your beautiful body. I'm busy. I'll do that later. Ah. Hmm. Ah, okay. Then I still have another surprise for you. <laughs> hey, this is for you. 
Je dis c'est en fiction. Hein. <rire> Yes, I, I know it's not much, but just manage it for now. Yeah? Oh. Hey. Wait, so, where did you get money you spent on this? Hey, hey. Oh, I did not tell you. Hey, you remember that my friend now? They usually call me for all these minor jobs and all that. You know, he called me for a job. So I went to the site to make money. Yeah? So when they paid me, I thought of you know buying all of this for you. Because I wasn't happy the way you went to bed sad last night. You know, I want you to be happy now. Hmm? I want to make you happy. Dennis, if you want to make me happy, you better go and find what other men are doing to get money. So you stop punishing me and your children. Eh, don't worry. Eh? God will shine on us very soon. So? Hmm? Very soon, everything will come back to normal. <laughs> don't worry, I have things I'm working on, yeah? <laughs> Hello? Obina? Oh. Uh, hey! Are you serious? Hey! Uh, I'll do it now. Okay, okay, I'm coming back to the I'm coming to the site. No, 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 no. Please, so don't give it to another person, please, yeah? I'm coming now! <laughs> thank you, thank you. Hi. <laughs> it's, uh, you know that my friend Obina, he just called me now. Uh, uh, there's another job for me at the site. So let me quickly go and do it so I can get money and buy some food stuff for the house. Yeah? Uh, let me quickly go and come back, yeah? I'll, you. I'll see you when I come back. Love him. <laughs> I know it's hard, but everything goes so. Well, all I need is patience. Just give me time and everything goes so. I know you've been trying. I know you've been patient. But a little more and everything goes so. Cause you know there's nothing I won't do for you. Nothing I won't do for you. And you know there's no I still I sit for you. Mm -mm. See, fine, babe. Mm. And that yeah, yeah, man. No, if he treats this goddess. Who go even believe say I don't drop two? Hmm. Asa. Cause you know there's nothing I won't do for you. Nothing I won't do for you. And you know there's no way I won't go for you. Is this love? Is this love? Hmm. I find sure. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But say if I take my time, marry better man. I follow the sofa, this nonsense, why the sofa? Hmm. Hello, Stacy. I do. I saw your message. Which time you want to come and get here? Today, they okay. I beg, wait for me, I beg. I will see you soon. I go come now. Oh, yeah, no. Uh, which hair you even do self? Hmm. Uh, which, which hair one five you make self? One five? Ah, one five no go fit do anything, no. Except now retouch, you know, retouch. And that one myself now only just to buy a relaxer. But I feel retouch and for you for free. Hmm, now why I take love, you know. Thank you so much, my friend. Okay, no. Thank you. Okay. Okay. No. Make I change this clothes before Stacy feels here they buy new clothes. But I know they money pay for her. I know it's hard, but everything goes so right. Babe, nah. Sha don't beg you. You know, sir, I don't explain give you now. Okay. Your husband, that's your husband the treasure. I don't tire. I swear, I don't tire. Except you go help me go beggar. Make it they try give me money. I swear, eh? Hmm. Let's try. If to say I listen to my cousin, mm -hmm. this is my husband where I marry. I've not married this my husband where I marry now. 
see me feeding from hand to mouth. Babe, he is really trying. I he bet is. they try. He's trying his best to give you the little he can get. You should appreciate it. I appreciate waiting. Not being mates, they buy cars for their wives. They build big, big house. Babe. All fingers are not equal. That doesn't mean you shouldn't appreciate the little fingers. Now, man, where they try, where they appreciate. Not be the one where they make me feed from hand to mouth. He even gave me 3,000 Naira to go and make my hair. Imagine that. Are you serious? He gave you 3,000 Naira? Oh, no, nah. I want five. I slip off tongue. Eh. Mm. Eh. I want five. So. Okay. My advice to you be say make you marry better man. No go marry potential low. Now the mistake why I make with that. Why this one they look person like this? Oh. There's one man behind us, he's just staring at you. No look, no look. Okay, okay. Ah, the weird guy is just staring at you as if he has known you before. I could even say that you guys have ever met. Hey. Hey. I know this guy first, we get this guy big car. Now in my life, still remain like this. Excuse me. Oh, I'm so sorry. 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 I'm so Babe, now that my 3 p.m. customer, mm -hmm. I beg, I beg, I beg, money first. I got to go. Let me go back to my shop. We'll chat later, okay? Mm -hmm. Thank you so much for the hair. I really appreciate it. You are owing me, yo. You are owing me, yo. Okay, now, later now. <laughs> Bye. Bye. <laughs> yes. Sorry, hope you don't mind if I. So, I'm actually in a hurry. Oh, come. Sorry, I won't take much of your time. <sighs> the lady is just off. Is she your friend? Yes. Sir, I hope you don't mind if I ask, is she married? Now you know why you're asking. Um, truth is, uh, I like her and I would like to know more about her. Sorry, my manners. My name is Buchi. Um, I'm a real estate developer. I'm into imports and exports. I actually export um, food stuff and home equipment, basically. I would really appreciate if you can convince her to call me at least. I doubt strongly if she's going to call you. Well, you can convince her, right? No, I can't. I'm sorry. 50,000 if you can. What? 100,000. If you can convince her to call you. Try me. <laughs> sorry, um, you didn't tell me your name. That's because she didn't ask. Sorry. What's your name? Stacy. Stacy? Nice name. Mm. Please convince her to call me. Okay, I have to run along. I'm in a hurry. It's fine. Okay. Take care. Out. Sure. the job you went for this afternoon? <sighs> job did not work out. Hoping I just wasted my transport money for nothing. What happened? <sighs> <clears throat> He's a developer. He didn't show up, so we had to wait for him all day. At the end of the day, he still didn't come, so we had to leave. What are we going to eat this evening? Um, maybe maybe we'll, we'll, we'll just um, manage the curry and granola that is left. So, you want me and the children to take curry again this evening? If you know that is not what I want. Eh? It's just the, the, the situation of things for me right now is just 
Somehow. My problem with you is that you always have excuse to why. Why what? Why what, babe? My children and I are tired of drinking Gary every evening. <laughs> but you know I am trying my best now. Eh, babe? I'm trying. I'm, I'm struggling to see how we, we, we can change from this Gary to, to, to something better. <laughs> and I know it will happen. Eh? You call this your best? <laughs> Father in heaven. If this is your best, I wonder what your worst would look like. You should try to understand this. Yeah? Try to understand. Okay. Oh, my baby. We'll drink to carry you. Are you serious, sweetheart? Mm -hmm. yeah? But I, I can still go out and get the tea and bread for you and your sister. Daddy, it's fine. We understand you don't have now. And we'll manage what we have. Okay. Okay. Thank you. I'll just go and fix the gary for you people, eh? Okay, we'll help you. Mm -hmm. I'll granules that I bought that we can use. Mm -hmm. You know how I used to prefer it? Mm -hmm. This could be, yeah. Hello, Stacy. You forgot your charger at my shop. I am outside your house with the charger. Come and collect it. Oh, okay. Come in. Mm -hmm. Ha, you don't want to come inside? My dear, no. I'm in a hurry. Mm hmm. Okay. Please give me my charger. Hmm, that's what I want to do. Ah, uh, has been so difficult to come back. Uh -uh. Where did you see estate developer's card from? My dear, I even forgot to tell you. The guy that was staring at you while I was seeing you off earlier. <laughs> the rich guy? Yes, yeah, so. Huh. I'm not even done. You will not believe it. Mm -hmm. He stopped me while I was going back and told me he likes you. <laughs> Man. <laughs> Not just that, too. Do you know that he told me he was going to give me 100,000 if I convince you to call him? 100k? <laughs> My dear, I know he's just bluffing. How did you know he's bluffing? Really? Who gives someone 100,000 just to convince her friend to call him? Tell Tracy, me. a man that has money, ego, mm. would do that. Okay. I don't hear you. I beg, take your charger, let me go in a bag. Thank you. Wait, see, wait, see. Let's do something. She he said, if you convince me to call him, he'll give you 100k. You are really not going to consider that, right? Mm -hmm. So let's call him and see if he's going to send it to you. Just tell him that you spoke to your friend and she accepted it for me. Babe, what if he sends the money and asks you on a date? What are you going to do? Stacy. We'll just go out and then he'll probably take me for lunch and then I'll just tell him that I'm married and he will run away. Are you sure? Yes, he'll leave me alone. Okay, I believe you. Oh, yeah. Let me call him. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this girl. Okay. Huh. Okay. Hi, this is Tessie. Hi, Tessie. How are you? I'm very well, thank you. And you? Okay, so I was able to convince my friend and she said she's going to call you. Really? Yes. Oh, that's great. Send me your account details. Let me fulfill my side of the deal and wait for our call. Okay, fine. What did he say? He said I should send my account details. He's Let him from his own side of the bank. I swear, babe. This guy in money Miss Rodo. Don't, don't conclude that. I, I, I doubt it. But let me just mm -hmm. send my account number. But babe, what if he asks you out on a date? Let's see. I will just go out with him. Probably we'll do lunch. 
And then I'll tell him that I am married. I'm a married woman. By that time, the money don't solve my family problem. Do you like the way I'm looking? Okay. You're right. <laughs> Just so this guy sends the money, Sha. I hope so. Let's wait. I sent the money. Wait, 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 wait. Let, me Let me see. It's my fake alert. Ha! This guy sent this hundred thousand though. This guy is serious. This guy now money Miss Rudo. He's very serious, babe. Okay. He really sent the money. He did. Baby. I beg, I beg. Send, send me my send my fifty k. You have to call him first. You know, I right? will now. That one will be a problem. That just call him first. You have I to call. Will. Just okay. call him first. Almost hundred thousand. This is real, man. Hi, this is Maureen, Stacy's friend. Hi, Maureen. I'm glad you called. Yeah, my friend said you asked after me. Oh, yes. See, I couldn't get my eyes off you this afternoon when I saw you both. So what are you doing tomorrow? Can we have lunch and pretty much get to know each other more? Lunch is fine. All right. What time should I call you? No, don't worry. I'll call you. Expecting your call tomorrow. Oh, okay. What he said he wants to take me for lunch. Really? Yeah. Okay, but you're going to tell him you're married, right? Of course. You promise? I promise. Mm. I will. All right, I believe you. Let me run along. Where are you going to? Here is my 50k. They sent you 100k. Here is my 50k. <laughs> Are you for real? You never even see 10,000 naira. Now 50k the ask No, no, try me. No, try Keep me. Keep dreaming. Better send me my 50,000 naira. Keep era. dreaming, sister. I've heard you. So send me my 50,000 naira. I've heard you. I have, I have to 50, run off. Okay. I have to run off, babe. <laughs> see you. Bye. Bye. Let <laughs> me quickly hide this. This man no get shame at all. Gary is what he still bring come house this night he came. We have so Gary for straight one week simply because I married an idiot that lacks shame. Drink, yeah? Mm -hmm. So you load your stomach very well. <laughs> <laughs> you can sleep well. Hmm? Mm -hmm. Mm -mm. My love. I usually don't want to come and join us. See, you see this granite? You know those Igala, Igala people granite that used to have that mixture of salt and milk? That taste. This is the granite. Hmm? The granite is nice, man. You see? <laughs> you better come and join us. So that I can. Hmm. Should I add more guys? Mm -hmm. Add more guys. You can add more guys. I can't believe that man just sent Stacy 100 k just like that. For him to just give away such amount of money. It means there is more to where that is coming from. See this one. If your hair is a person, you are looking at it. <laughs> what will I even wear to this lunch tomorrow? This one where I know you will get better clothes. I will find something presentable to wear, shall
Did they come out? Yes, I go my cousin house. Okay, you want to go and pick the girls? No, the kids are not coming back until 1 p.m. I they go give my cousin something, then follow go see one church woman like that. Ah. Uh, hmm. Okay, you go to. Oh, no, depends on the traffic. Okay. Oh. Hi. That one will be fine now. Mm. Hey, you're looking very beautiful. Mm. Huh? Is this one of those dresses that I bought for you? Yes. Yeah. Hi. Babe. I better take this and help me keep on inside. Hi. Look at my wife. Welcome. I'll keep it for you. Mm. I'll Come. see you later. Ha! Look at somebody's wife. Hi. Hi. Denise, you have eyes, oh. Huh? Eh? I'll wait for you in the night. <laughs> hey, let me I need your yeah. Yeah. Yeah, you're welcome to my humble abode. Wow. You have good taste. Really? Thank you. Anyway, <laughs> sit down. Well. So, um, what would you have me offer you? Oh, I will wait for lunch. Water. Water? Water is for food. Why don't I get you a glass of champagne or maybe something hot to calm your nerves? Okay. Okay. Feel comfortable. Don't laugh. Just feel at home. I'll be back. Hmm. The chef is so good. Yeah, that's why I had her. I mean, Jacqueline is one of the best around. So you live here all by yourself? Mm-hmm. Like, no kids, no wife, no girlfriend. Yeah. And that's why I want to make you my woman, so we can share this home together. <sighs> what? You're single, right? Sure. Yes, I am single. You know, it's... Difficult to believe that a lady as pretty as you is single. <laughs> yes. And that's the more reason I am still single. Because everyone keeps assuming I am in a relationship. Don't blame them. And it's harder to believe that a man as handsome as you are and very rich is single. Wait, you think I'm handsome? Oh, please. You know you're handsome, so don't rub it off. <laughs> you're funny. I get it, though. But the truth is, when you're young, successful, handsome, mm -hmm. like you said, it's hard to tell who really loves you genuinely, not what you can give them. True. Actually, um, I'm enjoying your company. Me too. I mean, you're so, you're so easy to talk to. Same here. <laughs> Thanks for having me for lunch. Thank you for honoring my invitation. You're welcome. Um, Mori, mm -hmm. I, I don't want you to get this wrong, all right? I think you have an amazing body, but 
your clothes, these are pretty much about me. So I'm just thinking I could take you out and get you really good designers wear. Shoes and bags as well. Really? Yeah, for real. Okay, thank you. Right? Let's go. Jacqueline! Yeah, I'll be back, all right? If you don't mind if I take you back to your house? No, don't worry. Stacy wants me to assist her at the shop. Wait, I don't get you two live together? Yes, we do. Oh, okay. Thanks for the shopping. Anything for you. So call me when you get home, yeah? I will. Bye. Bye. on you just for shopping my sister see i was surprised myself oh. did you see did you see the shoe yeah. look at the things this guy bought <laughs> you are very lucky you're so lucky look at this oh no no luck is an understatement <laughs> this is beyond luck <laughs> see my favorite right <laughs> girl this guy lucky you yeah but wait too you know this guy has been to demand for something in exchange of all this he has spent. You know, right? That one no be wahala. Make I finish enjoying my choppings first. Ah, this girl. What if he asks for sex? What are you going to do? Like I said, when we get to that bridge, we go cross her. For now, make I enjoy my choppings first. And that one cause I am. Are you sure you're not planning on having sex with him? The way I'm looking at you. <laughs> you're a married woman, no? You are married. You should better know that. So if they are counting married women, you will count me join. If one call, I beg you. Ha. You see this one. Babe, Dennis is trying. Dennis is a hardworking man. Uh uh. The man is trying to make sure he's, you, you're happy. You should appreciate that. You're very lucky to even have him as a man. Don't you know? You're very lucky. You call that luck? A man that feeds my children and I, Gary, for the past one week. Maureen. You didn't mock me, Abby. Maureen. The man is trying his best. The, the other time I saw him um, prizing shoe and bag for you, and I'm sure he has gotten that for you. Those are bar made. 
Maury! Abeg. Abba made or not, the man is hustling for you. Can't you see it? Stacy. Table turn so. Stacy. Let's change topic. Status changes. So. Okay. You have you, better have, know you, it have you seen this shoot? Do you know how much it costs? <laughs> Do you know how much it costs? I love this one. This one will size me. <laughs> You know what? I'm going to give you all this of these things size. so you keep them for me. You know, if I take them home, Dennis is going to question me, and I don't want that. That's true, that's true. No problem. I'll keep them for you. I'll be keep Why them are you there happy like this? No, go wear my clothes. Too. Ha. Hey. I'm serious. No, wear my clothes. You want to snap picture? No snapper, no. To one. snap picture, no. Snap nah. no one. I beg. Ah, no try. What give me, are friends for? Give me, give me my shoes. <laughs> <laughs> no try. I'm it's it. okay. Let me. Let me. Let me go keep them. Why are you me? Let me be keeping them. Keep them safe. Yeah. Shall we ever? The guest girl is down. I see them. Now, I enjoyed every moment we spent together tonight. So we should do that again, right? Sure. So how about dinner tomorrow? Mmm, sounds good. Okay. Have you tried the dresses and the shoes to know if they fit? Oh, I'm so sorry. They fit perfectly well. Sorry I didn't tell you. I love it. That's good. I mean, you should wear one of the dresses when you come in tomorrow. I will. <coughs> oh, okay. Can I call you back? Stacy just walked in and then I have to go mm. party some. That's fine. Yeah, okay. thank you. Who was that on the phone? Zeno Stacy. She just called and was complaining about her boyfriend. I better leave that guest to get Wala. The truth is, um, I knew you have an amazing body, yeah? But I never knew this this dress is gonna look sexy on them. Thank you. <sighs> so where are you taking me to? Um, I'm taking you to one of the best restaurants in town. Trust me, their meals are amazing. You will love it. You you like seafood, don't you? Yes, yeah, sure. Mm. Perfect. Perfect. You're gonna have a great time, all right? Let's go. She's not picking her call now. Hey, come on. pick your call now. Pick your call. Enjoyed the seafood. It was good, just like you described it. Amazing. Um, I'm glad you like it. I'm glad you like it. 
So who's been calling you all along that way in the restaurant? And why are you not picking their calls? That was my cousin. She's having a fight with her husband. But if I pick that call, <laughs> he's going to take like forever. Oh, wow. So I will call her when I get back home. Okay. Um, about what we were discussing at the restaurant, I, I really like you. Actually, I, I love you. I would really appreciate if you can give me the chance to be your boyfriend. I promise I won't take you for granted. Just, just let me be your boyfriend. I, I don't know. But, what don't you know? I like you a lot, Chooks. So what, what is stopping you? But then, if you're dating a rich guy, they always assume you're dating them for their money. But you're not one of them, right? Of course I am not. I'm not that kind of woman. I don't date men for money. So what is stopping you? <gasps> Please, give me a chance. Okay. Um, okay. Mm -hmm. Like... You're uh, gonna be my girlfriend, for real. <laughs> Thank you for making me the happiest man. <laughs> um, I guess it's your cousin is calling again. No, no, I have to go. Stacy is calling. I think it's quite late, so I think All you right. should take me Thank you. Uh, uh, these children don't sleep. It's already late. You know they sit tight. Not just nine thirty, na. Not just nine thirty. I've been calling you, and you're not taking my call. Where did you go to? I was at Stacy's salon, helping out. Stacy's salon. Yes. I went there to do some work, so I can at least get money to buy food stuff for the house. I don't even know say time don't go like this. Okay. It's alright. I, I... I... I, I made um, pap on Nakara for, for dinner. That's what we had. I don't chop for Stacy Sarah. Ah, God, I'm so tired. I just did work since morning where I come up for you. Just because I won't bring food for this house. Wait, wait. Um, this clothes is new. And the bag and shoes. <laughs> where did you get them from? I stay see you now. I borrow them. I get money buy this kind of expensive things. Stay see. I borrow me. I just make a rock and smoke. I beg I don't tire. Oh, she's so scared. Okay, dear. <laughs> I'll see you soon. <laughs> oh, oh, man. Hmm? Yeah. Did they come out? Yes, yeah, so I did go Stacy shop. Make I go see if I fit to small work. At least get some money. Come back. Ah, uh, and that one is good. Okay, even myself they come out now. I won't go run around and see what thing we feel come out for today. Uh. Eh? Mm -hmm. uh, so make a begin go. Please, eh? Make sure you lock the door, eh? Oh, okay. And keep the key for me for that place. Eh? Okay. Uh, okay. We'll see you later now. See you later. Uh-huh.
That's quite an expensive perfume. Oh babe, your hair is nice. Thank you. Um, your dress is different from the one you wore two days ago. Yes, it is. Hmm. They look quite expensive. It's from Stacy. Oh. She borrowed you everything you're wearing. Yes, because I have to look presentable while working in her shop. Hello? Wait. That's an iPhone ring too. When did she start using an iPhone? Thank you. I'll take care of that. Yeah, bye. You, you changed your phone? Yes. <sighs> to an iPhone? Mm-hmm. But how come now? How come what? But iPhone is very expensive now. Huh? It runs in hundreds of thousands in the market. So uh, you cannot afford it. Did I tell you I got it on myself? If you must know, Stacy gave it to me. Stacy again? Yes. Her fiance got her two iPhones and she decided to give me one. Is that not what friends are for? But wait, oh. Stacy have a fiance? Yes, she does. And he's doing very well. Unlike some people, that has nothing to do with their life. So stray bullets still got to me again. No problem. iPhone. An iPhone. I'm going to Stacy's shop. I'll talk to you later. Wait. A How did Stacy, that owns an ordinary roadside shop, get all the money she's squandering on expensive bags, shoes? And clothes. I am very sure she does not make up to 20,000 naira in a day in that her small shop. And even if she makes that kind of money, it's not enough to sponsor the, 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 the kind of lifestyle she's living, buying expensive clothes, shoes, and. No, 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 no. It doesn't just add up at all. This story doesn't add up. Something is not right. What will I tell her now that brought me here? Huh? Should I tell her that I just uh, 
I just came to say hello to her. Or oh, I think I know what to do. Let me just go in there. When I get there, something to say will not be a problem. What to say will not be a problem. I can let me just go. Has not been here since over a week now. Oh, um, over a week? Yes. Okay. Um, um, Ceci, can I use your phone to call her and find out where she is? I have no battery at the moment. Okay, sure. Excuse me. Okay. Well, thank you. Um, Android, is this your phone? Yes. I, I thought you used iPhone. iPhone? <laughs> in my dreams. <laughs> yeah, I want to see money by iPhone. I bet that one I'm for big men picking. I beg, I don't get energy. This is my Android, and I'm rocking it like this. <laughs> ah, okay. <sighs> um. Um, I'll just call her on my way home. My number is not reachable. Okay. No problem. Right. And Stacy, mm -hmm. um, thank you for for the gift you gave to Mari. What gift? The dresses. Dresses? Oh yeah, I mean the dresses you gave to her. Oh, oh dresses. <laughs> Dress, dresses. Yeah, yes. I, I, I dresses. gave her, I gave her some dresses, dress. Yeah. Wow, that's yeah. very kind of you. Yes. What, um, what is the color? Color. Yeah, I mean. Color, color. <laughs> I can't remember. Ah. Wow. <laughs> what do you mean you can't remember the colors of the dresses you gave to someone? I mean, you should remember now. Mm -hmm. right? Uh, you know, there is a lot in my head. Like I can't really remember. Mm. But why are you asking? Oh, nothing. I just, um, you know, just uh, wanted to say thank you for everything you're doing for my wife. Mm? <laughs> oh, yeah, she tells me everything. Don't mean sure. Well, I mean, what are friends for? Of course, mm. what are friends <laughs> for? <laughs> All right. Thank you very much, Stacy. I'll, I'll, I'll just be on my way now. Okay, sure. Um, All right. Yeah. Have a nice day. And you too. Bye. Bye. Mm -hmm. Bye. Thank have you. a nice day. You too. Bye. This girl will not kill me. This girl will not kill me. Hey, can you use me to lie this big lie? Did you even let me know about it? Hey. Hello, babe. Morning. I don't phone you. Babe, I don't fuck up. What happened? Gigi, your husband came here. You told your husband I gifted you some clothes. And you didn't even tell me ahead of time. At least let me know about your lie. I didn't tell him anything about you gifting me any clothes. <sighs> he came here thanking me for the clothes I gave to you. To your salon? Yes. What did he come there to do? He came around looking for you. Why? That is what you should ask him when he returns. Please, I beg. Please don't involve me in all of this. This man. This man. What him being problem Babe, I, I, I think he's suspecting that I lied. Leave him to me. I will talk to you later. Okay, well, you shall just know what you're doing, I beg. Hey. Daddy, 
baby, welcome. Oh, my well, baby girl, how are you? I'm fine. <laughs> you people are enjoying them. <laughs> no, you cooked. Yeah. We need to talk. <laughs> Is everything okay? Baby, take the food outside and continue eating. Okay, mommy. So you don't trust me, Abby? Baby, I don't understand. What do you mean I don't trust you? You don't trust me. That's why you went to Stacey's shop to confirm what I told you. Oh, no, baby, it's not what you think. What exactly do you want me to think? I told you something, you went behind my back to confirm if I was lying. No, oh, no, babe, I only went there to see you. See me for what? Okay, I, I I, wanted to discuss a job offer I got from a friend with you. That's, that's why I, I went there. A job offer that couldn't wait for me to get back home? Okay, this is what happened. My friend that helped me get the job needed a quick response from me to start processing the job. And the job is an out-of-town job. So I just needed to speak to my wife so we, we can have a discussion about it before I give him my, 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 my final response. See, 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 Dennis, I don't want to listen to anything you're saying. You better stop suspecting me. When all I do is go to work, try to earn money to put food on the table for you and the children. If you have a problem of me being the breadwinner of this family, then get a steady job and fix yourself. Stop suspecting me, Dennis. Stop it. I thought I knew you and everything. This new you, I don't know. Can you tell me something? Something that is deep. <laughs> Dear food guests, tastier by the day. You can say that again. Actually, I have a surprise for you. A surprise? Yeah. What is it? Go ahead. A key? Yes, to my house. Move in with me. I'm sorry, I can't. Why? I, I thought you cared about me that much. I care so much about you, Trucks. So why don't you want to move in with me? It's complicated. I thought you said you were single. I am single. Okay, maybe you're double dating. Hell no. So why are you turning down my offer? Trux, I'm from a conservative family. My parents won't be happy if they find out I moved in with a man who I am not married to. That's the problem. Yes. All right. I'll fix it. Yeah. 
He said he's going to fix it. What is he trying to do? been serious right now I've never been more serious in my life isn't it too soon Come on. I've known you for two months exactly just two months it doesn't matter how long we've known each other what matters is what I feel for you I love you with every fiber in me so what matters is what I feel for you and I'm willing to spend the rest of my life with you And be quick about it. Okay. What's up? Chooks asked me to move in with him. It's a lie. Yes. <laughs> but I told him I'm from a conservative home. Good. I can't move in with him. Moving with a man I am not married to. Mm -hmm. The next thing he did, he took me to a shopping mall. He bought a ring and proposed to me. <laughs> It's a lie. It's true. Babe! Babe, it's a lie. It's true. You're joking, right? I'm serious. How is this real? <laughs> and what did you say? Yes, of course. What? This kind of opportunities don't just come by. What about your husband? That dead beat. That one, our husband. <sighs> okay. And your children? Then get Papa now. Are you going to leave them with him? I can't take them along to Chuk's house. Chuk doesn't even know I am married, let alone have kids. Wow. Maureen, you're going to abandon your husband and your children just to marry another man. arrange money to settle Dennis, then he can take care of the kids. I can't miss this opportunity of becoming a better for God's wife. Um, why did you send the children out? Because I don't want them to hear our conversation. Sit. What is going on? Take it, open it, and you sit.
You want a divorce? Yes. Why? We are not compatible. What? What do you mean, we are not compatible? Maureen, we have been married for 15 good years with two beautiful daughters. And all of a sudden, you say that we are not compatible. Yes, Dennis. For the past 15 good years, I have not been happy. I've been living a life of misery. I can't keep living like that. Who is he? Who is who? Who is he? Who is who? Who is that man that you want to leave your daughters and I for? What man? I knew this would be the outcome, but I didn't believe it. This is the problem I have with you. How can I be married to a man who constantly accuses me of infidelity? Swear. I beg your pardon. Maureen, swear that you've not seen another man. Swear. Fiancé. Fiancé. Have I not been a good husband to you? Please, let's not do this. Maureen, why? How can you be engaged to another man? while still married to me. And that is why I'm here for you to sign the divorce papers so I can be free. Maureen, don't do this to me. For these 15 years of marriage that we're talking about here, don't do this to me, Maureen. Maureen, I promise to be the best husband to you, okay? To you and our daughters, please, don't, don't leave me. Don't leave me and our girls, please, I beg you. I would, I'm going to work harder. Okay, please just give me another chance. Please don't leave me and the girls alone. Please, I'm I beg not you. here for this. Sign the divorce papers and I'll be here tomorrow. No, no, to no. Leave me alone. No, 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 please. Please, no, 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 please wait. She what? Filed for a divorce? Yes. Why? I don't know. I really don't know. Someone is trying to take her away from me. Listen, I know you're her friend. You are her closest friend and she listens to you. All right? Please. Help me speak to her, okay? Help me talk to her, not to make this kind of mistake now. I will ruin my ma marriage, please. I beg you. Dini, you don't have to cry, okay? I, I will talk to her. I will talk to her. I just hope she listens to me. I believe she will listen to you. You are her friend, and I believe she listens to you very well. Anything you say to her, she will do it. 
Okay, please save my marriage. Please, no, 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 you don't have to. Please sit, mm -hmm. sit up. Look, I'm going to talk to her, okay? I promise, I'll talk to her. Okay. I'll save your marriage. Please, stop crying. Stop crying, okay? Marriage means so much to me. I'm 15 years. Please. I promise to speak to her. I promise, I promise I'll talk to her. I'll okay. talk to Maureen. Thank you. It's okay, you shouldn't be crying. Please. Wipe your tears, please. I'm going to talk to her. I promise you. You're not losing your marriage. I'll talk to her. Okay. Can you tell me something, something that is deep? Cause right now I don't know. Can you tell me how it's so easy for you to throw away what we worked for? Can you tell me why? Yeah. You threw Once again, my darling, sit. Oh, thank you. So what can I offer you? I'm fine. No, no, no. You can't be coming to my house for the first time and you're refusing to take something. Not even a bottle of wine. Your house? Yes, I live here. Dennis was at my shop yesterday evening. And he told me about the divorce he found. Yes. That's all he knows how to do. Run his mouth. So it's true. You want to divorce him? Stacy, I can't be married to two men at the same time. Don't do this, Maureen. Please, Stacy. Don't tell me he sent you here to talk me out of something that is impossible. He's your husband for crying out loud. <laughs> husband? This is what a husband's house should look like. Maybe if you had stopped criticizing him and then showing him little support, then he would have been able to achieve this or even more. So you're trying to tell me that? I am the reason he is poor. Oh no, no, Richard. He's a good man, Maureen. A good man? Wait, no money is no good at all. So it's all about the money, Maureen? You don't care about your husband or your children. Please, 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 let's change this conversation. Come with me. Let me show you the wedding dress. I will love to rock. <laughs> no. I came to stop you from making the biggest mistake of your life. But it seems like you've made up your mind to ruin it by yourself. If there was any mistake I have ever made, it's to marry that fool that don't know how to shut his mouth.
you will regret this action you are about to take, Mari. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Mrs. Too Good. Can you please leave my house? Since you have decided to be toxic to my happiness, don't you ever call me again. And you know what? If you love Dennis so much, why don't you just go ahead and marry him? Leave my house! Leave. Leave my house! Were you able to talk to her? Yes, I did. But it didn't go well. What? What did she say? She has made up her mind to be with Dennis. I am very sorry. I know. All right. Thank you very much for speaking with her on my behalf. <laughs> Stacy, where did you meet with her? I thought uh, she invited me over to the man's house. Okay. Can I get the address? You know, let me go and see her and talk to her myself. Maybe she will listen to me. Please. Did you know this place? Mori. Stacy gave me the address. The fool. I knew she was going to give you my address. What do you want? Mori. Mori, please. Mori, we need you back home. Thank you. The girls are really missing you. They want their mother back home, please. Dennis, 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 Dennis. Why do you always like to act so pathetic? Now you're trying to use your children to manipulate me. Huh? Please, you better get your broke self out of my sight. Else I will call the estate security on you. Mori, Mori, please. Mori, Mori, please. Mori, please, I beg you the name of God. Don't do this to me. Okay, don't do this. Maureen, anything you want, anything you want, just say it, I'll do it from today. Anything you want, I'll do. Please don't just leave me and the girls alone. I beg you in the name of God. Please, please. Dennis, like I said, you better get your sorry self out of my sight. I am going to call the estate security mm. and they will lock mm. you up. Mm. And you and I know that you cannot get yourself bailed. Nonsense. Chidi! <laughs> get this idiot out of my sight. Maureen, Oh God. Please, 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 please. Oh God, please. Let me just speak to her. Wait, Maureen, Maureen, come back. Maureen, let me try. Let me just speak to her. Respect yourself. Please, I beg you. Maureen, Maureen, just, just one minute. Let me, let me. Please, 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 just respect yourself and what you look like, and get out of here now. Please, now let me. Got, wait, now. If they, if I, if they reach here, now, look, they all right for you. I beg. I show you how you go pick up. I beg. Just help me yes. call her. You know the joke. Just, no, no, just let me. Just help me call her. Let me talk to her, please. I beg you. Just be going. Just be going, please. Please. Just be going, please. Just help me. Let me just say no, no. one last word. Eh? Huh? Boris. Are you still here? Boris. 
Oh God, they will deal with you. I'm telling you for your own interest. You don't call him already. You don't know this woman. Things we're not going to get to this extent. Mm -hmm. You told me that you were going to tell him that you're married. What is going on? Oh, so that is why you gave him my address without my permission. It's your husband. Stop it! Stop it, Stacy! You're not in any position to tell me who I choose to be my husband. This is my life. I should have known better than to trust you got my back. I have your back, Maureen. I have your back. And that is why I will tell you the truth. I am not going to fake things with you. Look, Maureen, you are making the biggest mistake of your life by marrying a man you barely even know. No, you're jealous, aren't you? Oh, please, don't be ridiculous. You're jealous because he chose me instead of you. Now you are being delusional. I gave you his contact, didn't I? Mm-hmm. If I didn't want to, you wouldn't have smelt the card in the first place. How much more saying it? Because you didn't know things would get this serious with me. I am so disappointed that you don't even know me. You should know me better than this, that I don't go for money because it comes and goes. I go for the real substance, something money cannot buy. And it's quite disappointing that you are too shallow to see that in Dennis. <laughs> Dennis again. Since you care so much about Dennis, I dash you, the poor bastard. But don't you ever call my number again, since you can't be trusted or stand my happiness. Goodbye. Thank you for coming. Please sit. Have you signed them? Can you sit? We need to talk. I'm not here to talk, Dennis. So what are you here for? Take this. That's a check of one million naira. You can use it to start something for yourself, a business, or probably remarry. Just sign the papers and let me go. You want to pay me to sign the divorce papers? Yes, Dennis. It will go a long way for you and the girls. For me and the girls? So you're truly abandoning the girls and I to marry another man, Maureen? Please, Dennis, don't make this harder than it already is for me. So it's true. You're leaving us. What is this, Dennis? I thought you said they were not around. They wanted to know the truth. So I asked them to wait and see for themselves. Just sign the papers and let me go. Sign the papers and let her go. Please. Okay. Please. <laughs> please don't leave us. Mommy. Please. Please don't leave us. Please. 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 Please.
And, and for this, you wanted your freedom. Now you have it. So you can go out there and live the life that you've always wanted with your ill gotten money. You're even more stupid than I thought you were. Oh, Henceforth, this is where you'll be selling your market. The street is not safe, okay? We're not going to be going around. No, you can't be walking. The street is not safe. Just stay here and sell your market, okay? Uh, let me get you chairs to sit. By the way, have you had anything to eat today? No. Nothing at all? Yes. Okay, I'll get something to eat too. This one now, 100 naira. 100 naira. 100 naira. This one now, 100 naira. This one now, 100 naira. Alright girls, so it's why you sell your market, okay? There you go. Hi. 
She gave you a spot outside her shop. Hmm. Yes. She said that the street isn't safe for us. Besides, she told us that she wanted to keep an eye on us. And there is marketing where she gave also. That's why we sold everything now. Eh? Uh -huh. Hey, and she even bought food for the two of us. Better jello fries, you big meat. And uh -huh. bottle water. Eh? Uh -huh. Hey. She's a good person now. That she's a good person. Yes, she is. Uh, hi. Okay. And um, there is Gary and um, the sugar and granola that oh, I no. bought. Huh? No, thank you. I won't spoil my taste. No, 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 no. no. You don't want to drink Gary? No, I don't. Want I bought you that sweet granola that we use. Mm, well, should we go and drink it alone? Mm, mm, drink it alone. Eh, because you people have eaten jello fries. Mm. That is Stacy's handwork. I see. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm happy. I'm happy. Ah. Auntie Stacy. Alright. Hello, my sweetheart. How, How are you? How are you? How are you? Fine. Hope you slept well. Yes, you good. So, did you bring your uniform like I instructed you? Yes. Good. Sweetie. So wear them now. But Auntie Stacy, where are we going to? To your school. We're going to your school. Our school? Uh -huh. They told us not to come back if we haven't paid our fees. I know, right? Don't worry. Allow me to handle that, okay? So change it to your uniform and let us go to your school. Okay. okay. All right. Um, you can go in here and change, okay? Okay. All right. Hurry up, girls. Um, to make sure that any of the person that comes in here, I have a client that's supposed to come in. So just have to be ready to make sure that's... <sighs> Alright girls, you guys can stop from here. You can start going back to your classes, okay? Just Stacy, thank you very much for paying our school fees. We really appreciate it. It's okay, don't mention. And don't forget to come back to my shop when you're done with school. Don't worry, I'll help you sell your market before you return, okay? Oh, thank <laughs> you. Thank you, God bless thank you. Thank you very much. Oh. Thank you so much. It's okay. Oh. I love you. I love you. I love you. <laughs> Lest I forget, let me give you guys something for snacks. Okay? Have this for you. Thank you, you. Thank, right. you okay. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. All right, so hurry up before you miss any class. Okay. okay. All right. Thank you. Love you, girls. Love you. <laughs> Bye. You mean she paid your school fees? Yes. We went with her to our school today to get our school fees. Mm. Yeah. And she even helped us sell while we were in school. And she even gave us money for lunch. Eh? Huh. Yes. She paid. Wow. Ooh, I see. Mm. Um, you know what? You can go in. I made spaghetti for you too. Hey, mm. like spaghetti. <laughs> I know you're hungry, so go in and eat, okay? <laughs> Stacy. Hi, Dennis. Um, how are you keeping up? Um, I'm good. Please sit. Um, don't worry. I I was actually working on a site, so I just decided to breeze in and say thank you for, you know, giving my girls a spot to sell. I mean, they told me about everything, and also clearing the school fees. Oh, that's very much. I really don't know how to thank you. Seriously. And also thank you for helping them to sell while they are at school. No, Please don't mention, okay? 
Thank you. From the deepest part of my heart, I just want to say thank you. I mean, my God will bless you for everything. Okay? You don't have to. No, I have to. I mean, you don't know how much it means to me seeing my girls go back to school. And, you know, it means a whole lot for me. All right? It means a whole lot. Thank you. It's okay. Uh, I don't mean to interfere, but I overheard them talking about a business you wanted to start. You don't have capital for that. Oh, they, they told you about it. Like I said, I overheard them discussing it. So tell me, how much are you talking about here? Listen, you've, you've done so much for me already. Okay? Look, your girls need to stay in school. And the only way that can be achieved is if there's a stable income. You need something stable that can take care of you and the girls. So please, allow me help. It's, it's not a small business. The, the capital is really on the high side. So, how much is it? It's about a million or two. <sighs> I do not have that kind of money. But, one of my brothers work in the bank as a bank manager. I could talk to him to loan you such amounts to start uh, your business. You will? Yes, with me being a guarantor, I believe he's, he's going to give you the loan. Sissy, Sissy, thank you. Oh, Sissy, oh, just, Sissy, oh my God, don't do Sissy, just thank, thank you, thank you, thank you, you don't very have... much. Thank you. You don't know how much this means to me and my girls. Honestly, I, I, I really appreciate you. Thank you very much. It's fine. It means a lot to no, me. don't thank me yet until tomorrow. No, I have to thank you. I have to thank you. Like this is this is this is a dream come true. You don't understand the feeling. Really, I, I have to thank you. It's fine. I appreciate it's you. Okay. Thank you. It's thank it's you okay. so much. You're welcome. It's okay. It's nothing. Thank you. Uh, I'll see you tomorrow. Okay, yes, just come by 7 a.m. so we can go there. No, 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 I can, I can even come by 5 a.m. Even 4 a.m. What am I doing? I, I, don't need, I don't need to sleep. No, okay, sleep. I'll just be awake all through the night. I'll oh. come in the morning, very early in the morning. But I, I, I don't need to sleep. I'll just be awake till morning. It's just... fine. 7 a.m. is fine, okay? Please. Thank you so much. 7 a.m. Okay. Thank you. This has been a lot. I can't wait to tell the girls. Can we okay, let me quickly run back to the site, okay? Okay. Thank you. My God God today. Bless you. God all right. Bless you. Bye. Bye. <laughs> such a very nice and gentle man. Some people will not value what they have until they lose it. <sighs> Hi. Stacy. I am so happy. I mean, you, you're a godsend. It's fine. All I just want you to do is just be judicious with the money, okay? I will. I promise you, I will not disappoint. I know. You have always been a hardworking man. And I know you are going to maximize this opportunity to grow the business. You know, no one has ever believed in me like this. I do. Thank you. Thank you. This, this, this means a lot to me. It's okay. You should run along before your girls return from school while I go back to my shop, okay? All right. Thank you. All right. All right. I'll, I'll see you later, eh? Okay, no problem. Yeah. Have a nice day. All right. Bye.
Hello, Stacy. <laughs> How is work going? Um, I I don't know. Do you have a moment? I I want to come pick you up right now and take you somewhere. I need to show you something. Okay, that's fine. Uh, just get ready. I'll be coming to pick you up any moment. 
All right, see you soon. Bye. You haven't told me why we're here. This is our new home. <laughs> what? Yes. I just bought the house last week. That's the thing I told you I was working on. God, this is so beautiful. <laughs> I, I love the interiors. Thank you. Look at this. <gasps> you own this house? Yes. Thank you for so helping me get the loan to boost my business. <laughs> and by the way, I, I I paid off the loan. Yeah, my brother told me that. And I'm so happy you didn't disappoint me. Of course, you know I will not. <laughs> I'm, so, I'm so happy for you. I mean, look at this. Just look at this. <laughs> and Stacy, we owe all of this to you. Oh, come on. You shouldn't give me all the credit. I mean, we all put in effort to make this dream come to reality. <laughs> and I'm so happy we did. <laughs> Look at this. Come on. Chevy love can taste like this. Chevy love can feel like this. So this love is sweet like this. My beautiful darling. What more can a man ask for? If not this. A beautiful home. And a coon like you in it. What are you talking about, Dennis? Stacy, you're a very good person. You have a good heart. So now I found love. Is this lover? Initially, I thought it was just me. Until recently, when I realized that my girls share the same sentiment. Dennis, you still haven't told me what you're talking about. They have grown to see you and love you as their mother. We want you around. Move in with us. Yes, who is there? Good evening. Yeah, good evening. Mm. How are you? Um, please, who are you and who are you looking for? Please, is your Oga around? Yes, my Oga is around. Okay, okay. Please, who are you? I'm his family member. Oh. Yes, yes. Um, is his wife at home too? Uh -uh. Wife or fiancé? Fiancé? Yes. Um, is he engaged? Ah, Tete now. Te ah, they have been planning to marry self. Now, God, they don't tell me, I'm not going to understand that. Huh? Is that so? Mm. Hi. Okay. Um, does his fiance live here with him too? Ah, uh, madam, which one are you doing now? You say that you're a family member. This jam question, what you can't ask me? I don't. Uh. 
No, I'm his I family beg, I beg. member. It's just that's how my brother operates. Yes, he doesn't tell us anything until he sets to do it. That's why. Mm. Yes, <laughs> no problem, no problem. Um, I I forgot my phone in the car. Eh? Let me get it so I can name. I can call him. Okay, eh? okay, no problem. Yes. All right. Okay. <laughs> Okay, I'm coming, I'm coming. Okay, they go. Stupid, Are you ladies looking for someone? Is she the one? Yes, and she's the one. Where is he? Where is Chooks? Chooks? Yes, Chooks. The idiot I left my house in his care. Your house? Are you there for something? If you must know, Chooks is my husband. Your husband? I don't know. Why she repeating everything that I say? Enough, madam. I will not have you come into my house to insult me. Your house? <laughs> yes. My house. Thank God my husband is here. Hey, honey. Honey? So this is what you do with my money? What? I didn't do anything. What? No love. I... I... Love? Just shut up. I'm trying to have a conversation with my wife. Honey. Um, it's not what you I heard you're planning to marry her. Marry? No, that's not possible. I don't know. I can't. I won't. What? Shut up. Shut up. I walk my bones off. Yes. Sent you money from abroad. Sending you money for you to invest for the family. And what do you do? You squander my money. On this cheap thing. Excuse me, madam. Enough of the name calling. <coughs> Jokes! So you would stand there and watch this woman slap me and disrespect me in my house! Warren, I, I think it's time to leave. What? Warren, go inside. Pack your thing, everything that belongs to you, and leave this house now. You can't be serious. Hmm. Mother! Chilly! How much is the salary every month? That is enough. It's enough. It's enough. Go in there, pack everything that belongs to this woman, and return her back to the gods I got her from. I'm yes. not going anywhere. Chili! Chili! Yes, ma'am. Pack everything that belongs to Chooks and get it out of this house now. Yes, ma'am. Everything I mean. Yes, ma everything! Honey, 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 do, do you know, do you know, you and I will be struggling too. Maybe pregnancy, so I'm actually using her to get maybe for us. 
then I can send her out. So, so you were trying to use me to get a child? I, I thought I said you should shut up. Shut up! Shut up! My keys. Keys? Yes, you heard me. My keys. My keys! I don't. I don't do this for us. Okay, do you own this house? No. So get out. You didn't lie to me too? Huh? I lied to you? Really? You were married with two children. And then you look me in the face and lie to me. Who told you that? What were you thinking? I made my inquiries before I even asked you about it. So you knew all this while and you proposed to me? Wait, you think I'm a fool? <laughs> Why do you think I kept on postponing the wedding? Because I wanted you to move in with me. Bear me a child for my wife and I. That way I can send you back to your sorry and broke husband. How dare you! How dare you! Just slap me. Yes. Sometimes the painting might look good from the outside, but don't let it fool you. The inside yes, might not be that? what you think. Yeah. Good How may I help you? Where is my husband? Mr. Dennis. Oh, Dennis, the former occupant. They have moved. They have moved from here now, like some weeks ago. They've moved? Yeah, I now occupy this place with my husband. Do you know where they live now? Yeah, I remember one time like that, the landlord was talking to somebody else and was telling the person that he has moved to his own house, one estate like that at uh, Jubil. I don't know if you know the place. Dennis owns a house. I'm sure of what I'm saying. No, 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 not, not the Dennis. Dennis. Well, I don't know. You can... Talk to the landlord, you know, ask him, he'll give you more information as well. I don't, I don't know how else I can help you. Do you have the number? Whose number? The landlord. Yeah, I think I have his number. Let me get my phone inside. Okay, thank you. Don't judge your book bag is covered. In the house. Oh, the glitters are not gold. They are not gold. Yeah. Yeah. Don't judge your book by its cover. All the glitters are not gold. They are not gold. Yeah. Yeah. Don't let what you see confuse you. <laughs> what are they doing, man?
Who is that? Anissa, are you okay? Anissa, are you okay? What are you doing here? Wow, not even a high. How did you get in here? Your How? estate security allowed me in. Is the security allowed you in? So what are you looking for? Honey? Yeah, baby. What is going on here? What is going on here? Hmm? You and Stacy. Yes. She is my wife. I'm the most amazing stepmother to the kids that you abandoned. You backstabber! Don't, don't, don't you dare, okay? Don't you dare speak to my wife like that, okay? Don't try it. You can't do this thing. Why not? You filed a divorce, remember? I thought you finally found someone who is compatible with you. So what are you doing in my house? What? I made a mistake. Baby, please forgive me. We, we can't be family again. Please take me back. <laughs> we, we can be family again, mm -hmm. right? Mm. I thought we are not compatible. So how can we become family again? Mm -hmm. Yes, I made a mistake. Please forgive me. I promise I will do better this time. I of promise. course you will. When I call the ST security to throw you out. <laughs> how dare you? You thief. You stole my family. You betrayed me. Oops! You betrayed yourself because I want you. You want me? Oh, yes. I told you you were going to regret letting a good man slip out of your fingers. But what did you tell me? Maureen, what exactly did you tell me? That if I wanted him, I can have him all to myself. Mm -hmm. That you dash me, the poor bastard. Mm -hmm. So what are you doing here? Why are you here begging the dead bits of a husband like you've always called him? You're a witch, Stacy. Oh, please. So this was your plan all along. Mm -hmm. You stole my family. That was the reason why you introduced me to that thief called... Oh, please shut up. Just shut up your mouth. I never introduced you to anyone. <laughs> Maureen, I tried so hard to warn you, but you never listened. Oh, you were so blinded by money that you couldn't even see the treasure standing right before you. You know what? You played yourself. And you should live by the consequences of your selfish action. Dennis, <laughs> baby, baby, please. Please forgive me. We had a history Stop. Stop. Stop that. It's Maureen. Listen to me. Maureen. 
I don't want to hurt you. Okay? So I'm going to say it again. Respect yourself and leave here now. All right? How can you even be comfortable marrying my friend? Oh, yes. Oh. I am comfortable <laughs> marrying your friend. You know why? Because she was there for me and the girls. You see everything I own today? The cars, the house, and everything. The good life that I enjoy today is because of her. She believed in me. She believed in my vision, my dreams, and everything. She supported me. So, why won't I be comfortable? So now listen to me. Listen to me. Pack your bags and leave. I'm going to call this. Don't do this. I need you to come to block. Unit five. Okay. Come and bundle this mad man out of this place right now. I just want to focus on what I believe. Mm, what I believe. What you see might be deceiving. What you heard might be deceiving. I just want to focus on the things that I know. Sometimes the painting might look good from the outside, but don't let it fool you. The inside might not be what you think. Yeah. Don't judge a book by its cover. All the glitters are not gold. They are not gold. Yeah. Yeah. Don't judge a book by its cover. All the glitters are not gold. They are not gold. Yeah. Yeah. Don't judge a book by its cover. All the glitters are not gold. They are not gold. Yeah. Yeah. Don't judge a book by its cover. All the glitters are not gold, they are not gold, yeah, yeah. Don't judge a book by its cover, all the glitters are not gold, they are not gold, yeah, yeah. Don't judge a book by its cover. All the glitters are not gold. They are not gold. Yeah, yeah. Don't let what you see confuse you. Don't let what you see confuse you. Don't be deceiving. Gently, gently down the stream. Don't let the ocean, don't let the ocean determine your direction. You get your loss from the things you've seen. You get your loss from the things you've heard. But you don't know what's going on on the inside. The sound of bitter cola is not the same with the taste.